잠시 후 2019학년도 3월 고2 전국연합학력평가 영어영역 듣기평가 방송을 시작하겠습니다. 1번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Esther, I heard from Jack that you had an accident. Yeah, I fell down and twisted my ankle. That sounds painful. Did you see a doctor? 2번 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. What are you looking at on your smartphone, Jason? Oh, I'm looking for a place to have my mother's birthday party. Really? I know a nice Italian restaurant downtown. 3번. 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello everyone. These days, children tend to have vision problems because of too much time spent on digital devices, and many parents are worried about it. However, there are things you can do to keep your child's eyes healthy. First of all, set screen time limits for your child. Second, provide your child with nutritious foods, such as vegetables, fruits, nuts, and fish. They contain nutrients that are good for your child's eyes. Third, have your child wear protective glasses when they play outside in the sun. Last but not least, have your child's eyes examined regularly. Remember that prevention is better than cure. Thank you. 4번 대화를 듣고 여자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Are you trying to buy something online, Neil? Yes, Mom. I just found a nice item online. What is it? This black leather jacket. They sell it for only $60. That's very cheap. But did you check if the shop is authorized? No, I didn't. Do I have to? Well, you need to be cautious. There could be online sellers you can't trust. You mean they could take my money without delivering my order? Yeah. That's why you need to buy things only at reliable online shops. Okay, Mom. I'll check that before I buy the jacket. 5번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello, Miss Johnson. Hello, Mr. Baker. I'd like to talk to you about the commercial for my restaurant. You mean the new menu commercial? Yes. I think there's a problem with it. Really? May I ask what that is? Well, according to our contract, the commercial is supposed to be aired before the evening news on your station. Yes, I remember that. But the commercial was not broadcast yesterday. Is that true? Yes, I checked it myself. Okay, Miss Johnson. I'll talk with our staff about that and fix the problem. Thank you. I want you to do it as soon as possible. 
6번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Grace, come look at this showcase. These items were donated by sports stars who graduated from here. Great! Who is the man in the rectangular picture frame? That's Larry Smith, the best player on the national baseball team. There's a baseball bat next to the picture frame. Is it one of his? Yes, he hit his 100th home run with that bat. Oh, really? Whose glove is it in front of the uniform? It's Larry's, too. He used it when he was in high school. I see. The basketball in the middle has a letter K on it. What does it stand for? You know the basketball player Kevin Jackson? K is his initial. I didn't know he was a graduate of your school. Look at his trophy beside the ball. That's the very trophy he received as MVP. Wow! You must be very proud of your graduates. Honey, I'm so excited that we're finally having a housewarming party. Me too. The guests will arrive soon. Is everything ready? Yes, almost. You've checked the oven, haven't you? Yes, I have. The chicken is roasting nicely. Good. The strawberry cake is in the fridge. Hmm, I think everything is all set. I'll take one last look at the bathroom. Oh, I forgot to replace the towels with fresh ones. No problem. I'll take care of the towels. How about the toilet paper? Don't worry. I've already replaced it with a new roll. Good. 8번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자와 함께 수리센터에 갈수 없는 이유를 고르시오. Hi, Max. Where are you going? I'm going to a print shop. My printer at home is out of order. Oh, that must be annoying. You're telling me. I have to fix it right away. Is there any place nearby that can repair electronics? There's one near the post office. I'm going there today to have my laptop fixed. Really? What time are you going? I'd like to go with you if possible. I'm going there at around 5 p.m. after Professor Simon's special lecture. 5 p.m.? I'm afraid I can't go with you then. Oh, you have a tennis lesson today, don't you? No, the lesson is tomorrow. Actually, I have an appointment with Professor Watson. I see. Then I'll text you the phone number of the repair shop. Thank you. 9번. 대화를 듣고 여자가 지불할 금액을 고르시오. Emma, we've run out of shampoo. Really? Then I'll order some online now. What's the price of the shampoo we usually use? It's $15 a bottle at this online store. How many bottles do you want me to order? How about two bottles? Okay. Do we have anything else to buy? Hmm, 
Let me think. Oh, didn't you say you need to buy toothbrushes? That's right. It's ten dollars for a pack of four toothbrushes. Then let's order two packs. Okay. I have a two dollar discount coupon, so I'll use it. That's good. Is there a delivery charge? No, there's no delivery charge for orders over twenty dollars. I'll place the order now. Maria, what are you watching? I'm watching the preview of the new TV drama Romance City. Romance City? When does it start? The first episode will be aired on March 9th. Oh, it's this Saturday. Yes. My favorite actor, Liam Collins, is the main character. Oh, he is? I like him too. The director is Sam Adams. He also directed Dreamcatcher. Really? I loved that drama. You know what? Romance City is based on the best selling novel of the same title. Have you read the novel? Of course. I enjoyed it very much. Redland Festival, and Hello, listeners. Are you looking for something to do this summer? Then, how about going to the Redland Festival? It is a fruit festival to promote good health. This festival is an annual event. Held in Blue River Park. This year, it will take place on Saturday, July 13th, from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. During the festival, an unlimited fruit buffet will be provided all day long. You can also participate in sports activities such as soccer and badminton. The $10 admission fee includes sports activities as well as the fruit buffet. Reservations are not necessary. Come enjoy this fun festival. Thank you. 12번 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 여자가 주문할 헤어드라이어를 고르시오. Claire, look at this. Five best-selling hair dryers are on sale at this online store. Good. I was going to buy a new one. Why don't you choose one with a higher wattage? The higher the wattage, the faster you dry your hair. You're right. I'll choose one with 1,500 watts or more. Which material is better, ionic or ceramic? The ionic model is good for my hair type, so I'll get an ionic one. I think the price is also important. I agree. I'll buy a model that's under $50. Then you have only two models to choose from. I think it's better to choose one with a cool shot setting. Yeah, with that function, you can dry your hair with cool air. Okay, then. I'll order this one. 
13번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Daniel, what are you looking for in the closet? I'm looking for my spring pants and shirts. Where are they, Mom? All your spring clothes are in the box here. Wow, you put all my spring clothes in this box. Yeah, look at what's written on the box. Oh, it says Daniel's spring clothes. There are many good things about storing off-season clothes in separate boxes. I think we can easily find the clothes we need when the seasons change. That's right. It also prevents the fading of colors. I see. Is there any other advantage? Honey, I'm home. What are you doing? I'm doing yoga. Aren't you going to the yoga center today? No, I'm not going there any longer. It's too far from here. But don't you think it's better to do yoga at the center? Yes, but I don't want to waste my time on the road. If you exercise at home alone, you might lose interest. Maybe, but I've found a nice fitness app and downloaded it on my smartphone. A fitness app? What does it do for you? It helps keep track of my workout schedule, provides personalized information, and so on. 15번 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 윌리가 수리 기사에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Willy is a student who lives alone in a house near his university. Returning home after school, he finds that the room temperature of his house is very low. It feels quite chilly. He turns on the heating system, but it doesn't work. Willie calls a repairman and asks him to come and fix it. The repairman comes and fixes the problem. Willie says thanks to him and pays for the repair. After the repairman leaves, Willie finds that one of the repairman's tools is on the floor. Willie calls the repairman again to let him know about this. In this situation, what would Willie most likely say to the repairman? 16번부터 17번은 두번 들려줍니다. 16번과 17번 다음을 듣고 물음에 답하시오. Hello, everyone. With technologies like artificial intelligence, it is possible to digitize homes. Today, I'd like to introduce to you household appliances made smarter with the help of technology. First are smart washing machines. Smart washers with AI techniques can sense the different types of fabric, so they regulate the washing strength and detergent. They can even send an alert when detergent is out of stock. Next are smart refrigerators. They allow the user to monitor food items inside. 
They can even show relevant recipes that can be made with those items. There are also smart speakers. Speakers controlled by voice commands can do various tasks, such as creating a playlist and searching the internet. Lastly, robotic vacuum cleaners can automatically clean the tight and usually overlooked spaces that are hard to access in traditional ways. Now, let's watch a video about these smart home appliances. 다시 한번 듣겠습니다. Hello, everyone. With technologies like artificial intelligence, it is possible to digitize homes. Today, I'd like to introduce to you household appliances made smarter with the help of technology. First, are smart washing machines. Smart washers with AI techniques can sense the different types of fabric, so they regulate the washing strength and detergent. They can even send an alert when detergent is out of stock. Next are smart refrigerators. They allow the user to monitor food items inside. They can even show relevant recipes that can be made with those items. There are also smart speakers. Speakers controlled by voice commands can do various tasks, such as creating a playlist and searching the internet. Lastly, robotic vacuum cleaners can automatically clean the tight and usually overlooked spaces that are hard to access in traditional ways. Now, let's watch a video about these smart home appliances. 16번 여자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은 17번. 언급된 가전제품이 아닌 것은? 이제 듣기 문제가 끝났습니다.